Hey guys, so as you probably know, I am going on vacation to Miami, and by the time you see this video, I will be on my way back. <laughs> so, kind of going time warp out of order here a little bit. Um, I'm going to show you what I have packed in my husband's suitcase and what I have packed in my suitcase, as well as our liquids and our carry-on, um, like little personal bags and all of that. So, I'm going to start with my suitcase. So I'll be putting these in eventually. <laughs> I haven't done that yet. And I will be putting in my makeup bag here as soon as I um, use it tomorrow morning. Um, so as far as my the main compartment of my suitcase, this right here is a cooler. And what I'm going to be putting in it is a whole bunch of meat. <laughs> There'll be a ton of meat inside this cooler. It's a 31 Gifts cooler. I can't remember the name of it though. It is soft-sided and it fits inside our carry-on. And our carry-on is the TLS Motherload Weekender by eBags, and I'll link it below. It's a fantastic bag. Both my husband and I have one. There are um, straps back here that make it into a backpack if you want to do it that way, or you can just carry it with um, your hand there. So it works out well. So then as far as the actual clothing that I'm bringing, we do have access to a washer and dryer inside the condo we're staying in. So we're not bringing everything for the week. We've got probably five or six outfits here that we can kind of mishmash throughout the, the week. Um, I've got three maxi dresses, a couple of short sleeve t-shirts, some undergarments, uh, capri pants. I have shorts down there, swimsuit, sleep clothes and some extra kind of like lounge around clothes and a sweater and it's going to be really really hot so I don't know <laughs> how much of this I'm actually going to be using but um, anyway so I have that and we'll be doing laundry halfway through the trip and then on this side I've got kind of a mesh pocket here that has some of our toiletries in them so I've got some wet wipes I've got our uh, toothbrushes this is a mending kit I've got a flashlight little um, shower cap and some earplugs, basically it, some wet wipes in there. And then in this bag, I've got some extra tissues and wet wipes. And this has some jewelry in it. Um, yeah, I think that's all that's in there. And this technically snaps in right here if I wanted to have it on top, but I think it's gonna make it too thick. That's why I have it over there. Big old sun hat and an umbrella just in case. And then since this is a condo, um, it's rented when we're not there using it as like a hotel. And so we have to bring kind of our own stuff with us, which is fine. I wanted to not do liquids this time because my liquids bag is getting ridiculous. So I've got a couple of dish towels. These little pods are laundry detergent. And then I got a little scrubby there I'll have to purchase some um, dishwasher or sorry dish soap while I'm there and I have dishwasher soap that's what this blue guy is right here it's um, not liquid it's powder so I can pack it in here and I've got the uh, dish gloves right here and just some cleaning gloves with some Lysol wipes and some uh, more wet wipes in here I do like to go over the hotel room I'm sorry the condo um, because it has been rented as a hotel when we're not there so just in case you never know all right and that is it for my bag so as far as my carry-on goes i have a kind of like a boho satchel and this is really my purse for the week um but i'm using it as my carry-on as well so i have some coupons to use at whole foods and hey to get some dish soap <laughs> How about that? And our boarding passes, I like to put them in a Ziploc um, because it keeps them from getting creased and then I can reach in my bag, I feel for the Ziploc and know exactly what it is when I pull it out. And I have some sunglasses, that's what these are. And I also have my pills. So these are the pills that I'm bringing for myself. I have some activated charcoal, some Advil, vitamin D and zinc, um, oregano oil, um, some potassium probiotics here. And then these are my digestive enzymes and ginger capsules, what those are for motion, sickness. And then in here, just some more kind of medicine-y type things. I have a little thermometer in there. I have some Ricola, cold calm, that's for my husband's allergies, and some oscillococcinum right here. Say that times five times fast. <laughs> that's for if we start to feel like we're catching a cold. I have some Dramamine in here, just in case I need it, and some Nerve Tonic, just some homeopathic nerve medication, as well as some homeopathic motion sickness medication. 
and right here this little container are my C bands and that's for flying for motion sickness we're also going on a boat so that's for that and some tea bags and natural version natural is relative of Dayquil just in case and then I also in here have some snacks gluten-free snacks this is my little beach bag right here some more wet wipes pen and pencil uh, what else is in here Kleenex a teeny tiny little salt container. Adorable, I know, right? And a Larvar, the Band-Aids. Yeah, that's about it. So all of that fits in this guy, which goes in this guy. And also in here have another cooler. And this is for our lunch, our breakfast and lunch snacks. Um, we are flying over both breakfast and lunch. So I'm going to have just a little bit of stuff in here for us to snack on until we get down there. Uh, we have an hour or so or whatever flight to Chicago and then a three hour flight to Miami. And then, oh, more wet wipes. Great. And another tea bag. <laughs> Just in case. You never know. You might need a tea bag. So there we go. There is my stuff. Ah, all right. Now, moving on to my husband's stuff. Um, and his bag, we're kind of sharing the disbursement of the toiletries here. So he's got some of the non-liquid toiletries on his side too. This is um, his deodorant, my razor, some floss, toothpicks, hair ties, band-aids, uh, nail file, comb, baking soda so I can wash my face. That's what that is. Uh, his deodorant, I think I said that. This is my sock for my sock bun. Yeah, anytime you see me have a sock bun in my videos, this is the sock that's on it. That's totally, yeah, yeah. I know. Okay, whatever. <laughs> so that's what that is. And he's got a little rain jacket here. And then his belt's in that orange case right there. That's what I was saying before, how you can snap it in if you want to. And then this is for his breakfast. These are gluten-free oats pre-portioned out for each day, plus some extra jerky. And we do bring... Oh, that's. A, I'm glad I'm doing this because I was going to forget my own towel. This is my husband's towel. I need to make sure I put a towel in my bag, too. We do bring our own towels. I don't know. We don't really have to, but it's just like a habit. We just do that. And he's got some shorts and t-shirts, undergarments in here. His, let's see, it's rash guards on this side. Yeah, that's what that is right here. So for his swimsuit, half his swimsuit, there's that. The other half's right under there. Some kind of lounge around pants. And like I said before, we'll be doing laundry, so we don't have everything that we need, but we do have a good mix of long sleeve and short sleeve t-shirts to get us through. Oh yeah, there's this one too. too. So as far as his carry-on goes, um, well, this is a carry-on, but I mean his at-seat kind of bag. We'll be bringing his laptop. So we actually use this bag and I'll link it below. It's one of my favorites. It's a, um, I don't remember the actual name of it. Is there something on here? V7. I don't know. That doesn't really give a whole lot of information. Um, it's one of those TSA compliant laptop bags. So he puts the laptop in here in this case. And then when it gets to the conveyor belt, he just lays it open flat like this and they can scan the laptop without having to take it out of the bag, which is great. So there we go. This is his bag. And he so lovingly has some of my magazines in here because I didn't have enough room in my purse. He's got for me, Mother Earth Living. I've got a gluten-free magazine and a Halloween magazine. And then this is for him to read. I'll probably read it too. Just a travel magazine. So we are good to go in the magazine front here. And he's got his bows. Um, I just bring normal earbuds with me, but he likes his bows. And he's got an extra battery in there. And then he'll also put in here his wallet and phone, just like I will in my bag. He's got his own snacks in here, pen and pencil boarding passes right there, uh, his own pills, and some more wet wipes, tissues, fork and a spoon, <laughs> I don't know. Okay, so there is that, and now let's go into the liquids bag. So I've got to disperse these a little bit. Um, I haven't done a real good job of this quite yet. But anyway, so these are the two liquids bags. He gets one, I get one that we put through security, but we share everything that's in them. So in this bag here, uh, let's see, we've got some uh, Bach Rescue Remedy, Lysol Spray, some lip gloss. This is my husband's own um, kind of cologne 
after sun lotion, some hair gel, shampoo and conditioner. So, oh, his face lotion. This is our toothpaste here. And that's all of his face stuff on that side. Then my side here, and I've got to throw some of these in his bag, but we've got some organic tamari soy sauce, gluten-free soy sauce. Uh, I don't know, it just prevents us from having to buy soy sauce down there. Um, we've got a lot of essential oils with us, so I've got thieves, this is good for boosting the immune system. We've got frankincense, this helps us sleep at night. And some lavender, really good for antiviral, is also good for allergies, we've got some lavender. Purification, just in case any of us get a bug bite or something, or we need extra immune boosting, purification is really good for that. And we've got some diagize here, um, used topically to help um, you know our tummies settle down if necessary. And Valor, any of you young living people, I know you're jealous of me right now because I actually have Valor because <laughs> it's like sold out. Um, so this I use for me um, for anxiety as well as to help sleep, so I love Valor. And then also in here I've got oh, the rest of my husband's face stuff. This is a counter spray, like um, a multi-purpose spray, so I got that to spray down the kitchen. Um, some bentonite clay just in case we have any tummy issues, we'll take that. I've got my liquid foundation right here and some mascara. This is our, hopefully this gets us through the trip, but we might need to get more. Um, some sunscreen there. I use nasal spray before I get on the airplane just to keep my nose moist and to help enhance my immune system. Um, so I have that. And then I also have them here. This is Motionese. I put this behind my ears to help with motion sickness or prevent motion sickness. And what is this? Oh, olive oil in here as my moisturizer. My deodorant down here. And I think that's it. Whew. Okay, so fastest ever. Actually, it wasn't fast. Tw 12 minutes and 25 seconds, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> kind of long-winded. Um, so I've got everything in here. I'm also packing the iPad, my phone, my earbuds. Got to put the meat in there. And a couple more sandals. And that's it. So there we go. That's what I'm bringing on vacation. Most of it's coming back with me. Um, I'm hoping to go through some of the liquids so I can just, you know, pack the empty containers in the suitcase so I don't have to worry about it on the way back. We'll see. And I think that's it. So I'll be doing a little bit of filming in Miami. You'll be seeing those um, upcoming in the next few days from now. Um, yeah, I think that's it. And there will still be a little bit of time, yes, to enter my Jamberry Half Sheet Nail Giveaway. So if you want to do that, click the link below and that will bring you to that video. I'll also put the link right here over my face. And... Yes, that's it. All right, guys, I hope you are having a great week. I will see you when I get back. Bon voyage. <laughs> see you soon. All right, take care. Bye.